Okay, well, the next thing that we're going to do, we've talked about a lot of games and stuff, but sometimes you just want to build something. And sometimes you're going to need a little bit of help with this, but there's still a lot of things from your kitchen and your garage where you can put it together and be independent. So what we're going to work on a little bit today, we'll show you certain parts of it, not the entire thing, but making something with wood. This is a little holder where you can put your remote, paper, pencil, keep it by the side of your bed, and you can reach it. That's a lot of the problem is finding something, reaching something, finding something at night. By making a little holder like this, it makes it easy for you. And you can pretty much do this independently yourself. So we've got all the parts, and many of the parts have been pre-nailed or pre the hole has been pre-made for us, so it makes it a little bit easier. Just like we did with our cooking, where we had our Velcro to hold things in place for us, I'm using Velcro again. And I'm going to remind you, keep that little strip on the end so it'll be easy to pull off afterwards. So you Velcro to the side of the object that I'm going to be holding in place, and I've got my Velcro strip on my workboard. So let's put that together. Next, you're going to take a larger C-clamp. I'm going to C-clamp this onto here and also to the back of the table so it's secure. I'm going to pick up our little piece on our pre-holed, pre-drilled nail. I've already started that in. I'm going to put that in position. We're going to C-clamp this down. Get it secure, have it secure. Then take your hammer and you can proceed. I'm not good at hammering. And get it all the way in. Sometimes when we're working with wood or when we're out in the garage, Sometimes you're going to need a little help or you want to make sure that your setup is secure. And if I had had a little bit larger of a C-clamp, I would have been able to hold that on a lot safer. And that is the most important thing. Think this through about what you want to do, where you want to get with, get with your project, and what's the safest, most efficient way for you to do it. And always remember, you're not going to be limited by your body, but you'll be limited on how creatively you can use your tools to get to your end goal.